Details about the next generation of AMD's RDNA 3 or the Navi 33 is what they're calling it have just leaked online by a reliable leaker named Kiriyoko. Fortunately, the rumors do sound good to be true as Kiriyoko was pretty accurate about the Ampere architecture months before it was even released. According to his point of direction, RDNA 3 is expected to be three times more powerful than the current AMD GPU lineup and the weakest GPU on this lineup is expected to be much bigger in performance than the current big Navi lineup to date. So without further ado, let's jump into the rumored spec breakdown. AMD has already made promises about the major improvements in performance in their upcoming RDNA 3 and now with their latest tweet from Kiriyuko, we are expecting to see similar specs on the Navi 33 as that of the Navi 21 GPUs. The only catch is, these next generation of AMD graphics cards will feature a brand new IP core. If that turns out to be actually true, then spec-wise, we are looking at a total of 80 graphics computing units with 5120 streaming processors on the Navi 33. This speculation heavily depends on whether AMD will keep the per CU core count to 64 SPs as per the already existing chip. An earlier rumor by Kepler L2 hinted that Navi 31 is also likely to feature 80 computing units but based on the RDNA 3 IP. Although it sounded too good to be true, this doesn't determine the full specification of what the chip actually has to offer. Navi 31 is going to be a MCM-based solution to feature chiplet-based dual AT compute units where each one will have 5120 core counts. So if we crunch the numbers, we are looking at a maximum of 150 compute units and 10,240 stream processors. Judging by this, Navi 33 is expected to have 80 compute units. As for the Navi 32 SKU, that would end up around 120 to 140 CUs based on the assumption of it being a multi-chip module. AMD sure needs to have a hefty GPU design to house all these and the process nodes is also likely to be going through some changes and might end up being something similar to TSMC's 5 nanometer design. Although all of these we have bragged about so far are just rumors and heavy speculations, AMD's recently filed patent on the MCM GPU chiplet design further reinforces them to be a wide possibility. One thing is for certain that the future is all about MCM. Given the fact that both Nvidia and Intel are working on this on their upcoming next-gen components, Nvidia is aiming MCM on their Hopper architecture while Intel on their Arctic Sound platform. It all comes down to the fact that who will be the one to reveal it first. And that is pretty much it of our breakdown of the AMD RDNA 3 leaks and rumors. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and comment below to let us know your thoughts. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Be sure to catch us on our next video.